Uh, hi, Mom. Dad, Kevin, Bobby, Buffy, Windermere Residents, Millican uh, students, Pi Fives, anybody who may watch this at some point if I ever finish making it. Uh, I'm, I'm in London and somebody's in trouble. This is London. Hello, London. How are you doing? Food. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, so I bought some interesting things down at the shop. It's called Sainsbury. It's pretty cheap stuff. And I just usually go through the aisles and see, like, what could I eat that's not terribly expensive. That's really my only requirement. And then I'm here to try new things, so I thought, you know, why not? So, so far, I've gone to the shop twice, and I don't think I've spent 15 pounds yet because I've been buying a lot of really cheap stuff. So here are some of the highlights of things that I have. Lancaster, chopped ham and pork. Scrumptious. For easy slicing, chill before opening. So you, uh, I'm gonna slice this up and put on a sandwich. Fish and chip leftovers. I bought Sainsbury brand soup. No fancy packaging. There's no fancy packaging in this town. Irish stew, cream chicken soup. Also, no fancy packaging. Curious, these two exact same packaging, only one of them identifies this one. This one does. Identifies a no fancy packaging. The other one says, simple recipe, warms the cockles. You will not see that on uh, any American packaging, I assure you. For obvious reasons, why they wouldn't put cockles. Instant noodle soup. Hey, everyone, look, special guest Courtney. Hey, Courtney. Oh, it's so bright. I was just talking about my ragu. I sprung. I sprung for the onion and garlic because I'm living large. Sainsbury. Sar oh, no. Sainsbury secret. brand. Sainsbury brand. It is whole wheat penne, penne. made from 100% durum wheat. wheat, perfect with a rich tomato and bacon sauce. Bacon. That's what I love about this place. They recommend bacon. that you eat bacon with it. High in fiber with an re. Oh, that's nice. Farley's Rusks, mini Heinz, brought to you by a, a, a ketchup company. Like I, I don't really understand, but Heinz uh, mini Farley's Rusks original. Um, I bought these because Charlie McDonald liked them in his uh, baby food video. So, Charlie, if you ever see this, I will die of embarrassment. It's got a little bear on it. Mini rusks for on the go, says little bear. And technically it's for babies, but if Charlie eats it, I'll eat it. Kellogg's Frosties, not Frosted Flakes. Just Frosties. And Cocoa Pops with a ambiguous monkey you know I think it's a monkey yeah it's a monkey innocent special fruit smoothie pomegranates blueberries and acai acai I, I don't know I'm not exactly sure how to pronounce it but anyway it's two of my five a day uh, it's delicious you want to see what it looks like mm-hmm uh, soy milk since I'm lactose intolerant Gala apples, not so exciting. The cheapest bread that was at the store. Oh yeah, 100% British wheat. High five British wheat. Sainsbury Basics, chicken paste. Do you see that? Let me get it at a good angle. No. It's like too bright right here. I just want to show you the chicken paste. There we go. Chicken paste. Awesome. Um, it's actually not too bad. It's like a very fine chicken salad. It looks like cat food. I feel like a cat. I pretend I'm a cat when I eat it. It's like playtime and food at the same time. I can't get the whole thing back. And that's the intro of Food in England. Okay, bye! How's it going, Kate? I have makeup on my face. What's going on? I was gonna check my Facebook. Are you checking your Facebook? Is it good? I was gonna check my Facebook. How's the word on Facebook? It's, oh, I'm not on it yet. It's oh, I'll be checking it faster. I have something to talk about on my YouTube.